This is A Minute with Marty with a great topic today. If you drive a car and have car insurance, listen to this. There are two important pieces of your car insurance. One is mandatory and the other is a necessary option. Now, why do I say these things? Why am I, why am I bringing this up? Here's some examples. Just because you got a, a, a license doesn't mean you should be driving, okay? Uh, you ever go to, uh, be driving down the road in the evening and the sun's going down and you see these crazy people that's just oblivious to the fact that it's dark and they're driving with their headlights off. It's a little bit dangerous. Another thing is you're riding down the road, you're already going five over the speed limit and you're going down the highway and these cats come up behind you and they're pushing you like this and they are in an absolute hurry to go nowhere for speeding. Another one is uh, people running red lights, having a traffic light out here at our office at our intersection. I can sit out there every day, all day long and watch people just go through red lights and oblivious to the fact that one, they're on the phone, two, they just went through a, a red light that's been that way for a minute or oh, one minute, a second or two. You know, you know, you know, just going, oblivious. Those people with driver license. Another one is, well, traffic light is out. This is one of my pet peeves. The whole traffic light's out and some of these buffoons are just going it through at 50 miles an hour like they're on the highway. What are you supposed to do with a traffic light? This is my public service announcement. It's a four way stop. That means stop. Makes it safe. So why'd I tell you this? Okay, why'd I bring it up? Those, those two pieces, two pieces that are important. One is mandatory and that's the uninsured. Motorists. You say, Marty, people really drive around with, without insurance? Absolutely. We get them come in. Say, hey, I have not been insured for the past three months on my car. I need to get some insurance. I wonder where that came from. And you go, are you crazy? And yeah, a lot of crazy people out there. So, why should you have uh, uninsured? Uh, one is if you just bought a brand new truck, $50,000, you got a $50,000 camper. That's a hundred grand. You're riding down the road, this uninsured cat hits you. Okay? Who's gonna recoup that hundred grand? He sure ain't. You can't, I mean, you can sue him trying to get nothing. You, you in the hole. So, uninsured is mandatory, but you can have the state minimum. You don't want state minimum. In South Carolina, that's 25,000, 50,000, 25,000. Let's just talk about the property piece right now. That same hundred thousand dollars that he just hit you and totaled your vehicle. If you got the state minimum on that twenty-five thousand, you're in a you're in a whole seventy-five grand. So make sure that mandatory piece is bumped up some. The other piece um, that I call a necessary um, option is the underinsured. That same cat to come in and said he didn't have coverage for three months. Well, he of course he's probably going to get the state minimums which is again on the property piece is that $25,000. So if he's got it and he hits you, guess what? Out of that $100,000 example I gave you, you're still gonna be in the hole that $75,000. So what do you do? You need to protect yourself and increase those limits and take that option. Again, it's an option, but we always quote it. Unless somebody said, I don't want it and we get you to sign. So up it. So if you upped it to a hundred grand and you use that same example and this cat hits you and he's underinsured, you got enough, one, you gonna, his is gonna pay the 25,000 and then you can fill in the gap and make sure that you are fully whole. So keep those things in mind because it, it's, you know, we're all out there and we're all driving with people that really shouldn't be driving. So protect yourself. That's what insurance is for. And here at HFC Insurance, we try to make insurance simple. So if we can help you, give us a call. Have a good day.